Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I finished my aesthetic morning routine already, which is why I am completely dressed and done. Please make sure you watch the video where it starts at the beginning and then goes all the way through my day until we get to this point. This is inspired by all of those that girl posts, especially on TikTok and YouTube. So I just want to walk through what it feels like to be that girl for a day and we'll talk about it at the end. We want to get a good start to the day. So make sure you wake up early, stretch, and get ready to get a great start on your day. First, I am going to peel a cucumber to make myself a cucumber water for a nice, healthy start to the morning, and then I can drink it again after my workout. It's really tasty. I definitely recommend it. Then, we're going to blend ourselves a smoothie with kale and oranges. It blends up the kale really nicely. Then we want to add frozen pineapple and mango and blend that up as well. Can't forget your still straw. Yum. Then, you want to take time to journal meditate, write down your thoughts, use a prompt, whatever it is you need, and be sure to do your workout. Make sure you make yourself some coffee to have ready for yourself, and take a nice, refreshing shower. Leave in conditioner. My hair is very, very snarly, and it's really long very thick and again definitely snarly so we're just going to spray some of that in and brush through and now we have some argan oil i don't know if i'm saying that right but we're going to just squirt some of this in my hair it smells super nice so you put some on your fingers and then just rub it through skincare we are going to use a little bit of this toner I don't think you can see it, but some stuff definitely did come off. And now let's do some hyaluronic acid with the PMD. We're going to use the side that has the pulse. We will put on some lip treatment. And you can't forget your sunscreen. Now we are going to use this artisan mug from Guatemala. I got it through a company called 10,000 Villages. And yes, I do like my coffee black. Then you want to do some daily social justice reading while drinking your coffee in the morning. And don't forget to make yourself a nice, healthy hearty breakfast so my aesthetic morning routine is complete i have put on my makeup and put on an outfit this is just a black jumper um, it's from pact and then this necklace is from my safari in kenya and then this is just like a cardigan that goes over because this is a tank top and it's not quite warm enough out for that today. So this is what we've got. I hope you enjoyed. Please stay tuned for the second half of this video though. That is actually the most important part of this video. I wake up and I scroll through social media. I spend way too much time checking every social media app first thing in the morning. Too much time. If I make a smoothie, I probably make a big mess out of it. Then I have to spend time cleaning up everything as well. That's not very aesthetic of me. Um, I literally don't journal. <laughs> and if I work out, I have to take an inhaler. Not very aesthetic. I frequently set off the smoke detector when cooking.
I dropped my food trying to take an aesthetic picture. So I don't actually do any skincare. I'm really lucky. The only skincare I actually do is put on this prescription ointment onto my severely eczema legs. They're actually better now than usual, but this is the only thing that I do really do. I do love reading social justice books, but just not in the morning. And then I usually eat breakfast while I am again scrolling through social media, wasting my morning. So, to be completely honest with you, this literally took me almost all day, especially to set up everything and then to record, and then you have to clean up all the mess that you made because you had to spend extra time laying out your clothes to make it look good to take a picture or a video, and there's so much extra time that you waste when you're recording these things. It is noon now. I can almost guarantee that nobody does these aesthetic morning routines every day. I will say maybe they have time to do it on the weekends. I could probably do this on the weekend and be fine. I do believe that there are people who wake up every morning and exercise because I used to be one of them. However, I used to literally just do that and take a shower, pour myself a bowl of cereal, and go to work. I never did a whole aesthetic morning routine. Literally, nobody has time for this. Additionally, I had to clean off some spaces before I set up the video to record myself, and most people's houses are lived in. Most people don't live in those videos that you see on TikTok. A lot of people might live in them. A lot of people might spend a lot of time cleaning or have maids or something like that. But I think for the most part, these videos are super fake. I think it's a lot more tempting for people to believe that people really truly act like this when it's a video versus an Instagram post because a video does take more time and it is a little bit harder to fake in a way. However, it's still pretty easy to fake. There's no telling that somebody recorded all of those things within their one hour in the morning or they spent almost four hours videotaping themselves for their morning routine. So I think it is really important to recognize I keep looking out my window because there's a lot of birds on my deck right now. <laughs> I'll have to show you them one day. But I think it's really important to recognize that a lot of these that girl aesthetic morning routines aren't realistic. If somebody is filming it, they probably only film it once or twice. It might take them all week to film it and then edit it and post a video. This isn't really real life for the vast majority of people. Even the people who you see making a video like I just did, this is not my morning routine. This is not realistic, nor do I even want to do this every morning. I will say that I do want to wake up and get my exercise in. Um, it would be nice to have a good green smoothie or something every morning, but right now I really only have it once a week probably. It would be nice to do a lot of these things and make sure I get enough water every day. So I can incorporate some of those aspects, but I think for the most part, this is just not realistic for me. I can wake up, I can add in a half hour of exercise to my morning every day, and I can probably make time for a little bit more water, but I am literally not gonna journal, I'm literally not gonna read in the morning, I'm literally not going to cook a breakfast and make a smoothie and I don't even know what other stuff I did for the video. <laughs> um, so please leave your comments and thoughts below. Be sure to click the subscribe button. I hope you found this insightful and let me know your thoughts.